Hi guys, it's Kali Shalom. Come on here again with another video to show you guys how I do crochet braids, but this time it's half up and half down. And I'm teaching you guys how, I'm not doing a detailed video, but it's showing you guys how I did it, how I accomplished my look. Um, different people on here do it a different way. So if you guys want to see how I get this style, just continue to watch. And at the end, let me know what you think of the video. So here's a closer look of the style. I hope you guys can see it. I hope I'm in frame. Um, a lot of people um, do theirs long. This time I cut my hair, but next time I think I'm going to leave it long because I think I would like, I like this style, but I think I would like the long better. But, um, you know, when you're using crochet hair, synthetic hair, um, it tends to mat up and get tangled. So that's why I went with the short style. But next time I do think, um, I'm pretty sure I would do the long look. But I'm feeling this style. I love this style. And again, if you guys want to see how I accomplish, how I get this look, please continue to watch. Thank you, guys. Hi, guys. This is Carly Shen, and today I'm coming on here to do the half up, half down crochet braids. Um, I'm going to be doing crochet braids in the back and then feeding braids in the front which i'm only going to be adding three pieces of hair in each braid and i'm crochet around my ponytail so i can make my bun and i'm using hair that i already have around my house um because i do hair so i have hair laying around um i already started separate separating my hair my braids and hair to do my feeding braids and i have some hair right here excuse me if i'm off the frame I have some hair right here to do my crochet and this is the Brazilian twist braid okay so as you can see I already started I already have section my hair off and I already did my small braids right here I have three of those and I also braided the back of my hair if you can see that I only did um, in the back I only braided my hair going um, in a circle so that's um that's the kind of braid pattern I use and that's what's easy for me. So I'm not gonna do too much talking guys. I'm just gonna start doing my hair because I'm pretty sure it's a lot of videos out here how to do feed in braids and it's a lot of um videos out here how to do crochet. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, like I said, I already did everything to my hair. And I'm going to be using the 24-hour um, edge tamer. Carlin, stop. Um, again, I'm going to be using the 24-hour edge tamer ultra super hold. And I like the way this stuff works. So, we're going to be using this. I'm just put this all around my hair, the part I'm be braiding right now. So I will. I'm only trying to leave it out a little bit. Like I said, I'm only adding three pieces of hair. Oh, 
And guys, I have a um video on here with me doing feet and braids. But I fear that um, it's so many videos on YouTube how to do feet and braids. I didn't think I need to really show you guys how to do that. We're going to braid all the way down because when we get done with this top part, we're going to put it in a, um, a bun, a little ball, so that we can crochet around it. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to do the other side. I'm going to work from side to side. with the front 
We're going to just wrap it around. Because like I said, we're going to crochet around it. Around the bun. And then put crochet hair around it. And then um, put it in the bun with the crochet here. Okay. Just wrap that around. I'm crocheting the hair in my head using the um, deep twist braids. Yeah, the deep twist braid, shake and go hair. I don't know if I told y'all that at first. But like I said the first time, I just had hair laying around my house. I'm going to try to make it so you guys can see me. And I'm only twisting around five times just to make sure that it stays. And if you want to make yours longer, you can. I cut mine in half, but you don't have to. So I'm gonna continue to fill around and continue to do my crochet all the way till I get to the top. And I'm not using a little bit of hair, I'm using a lot of hair so it can cover it. Hope you guys can see this. I'm trying to look in the mirror and make sure I'm in the frame also. So you're going to start messing with it so you can get it exactly how you want it. I don't want my bun to be perfect. I have work bands right here so I can put it over it. this is my finished look 
and I know this video wasn't real detailed, but like I said, it's plenty um, of videos here on YouTube how to do crochet, and there's plenty of braids, I mean, and there's plenty of videos on here how to do feed and braids. So all you're doing is combining those two together and to get this style. So I hope this video did help you guys a lot, and I hope if you try this, that you succeed in doing it. So, let me turn around. Crochet in the back. And the bun in the front. I really like this style. Thank you guys a lot for watching my video. Thank you.